All right, so here's a little view from the back side. So they just primed this here, this little painting, but you can see them up there, painting all of the ceilings white. Um, we still have a little bit of trim to do around that back there. Uh, and then over here, we're going to be making this, I think like a turf area. So we can play cornhole, possibly putt-putt, stuff like that. And um, we'll just be kind of making steps going down to it because it is a pretty drastic drop there. Uh, and then tomorrow they're actually gonna start making that wall all the way out here to the corner, which you guys know that is our problem area. So any hurricane that comes, the water tends to come up here and then have lots of erosion. So I think once we get this wall built here, we'll be golden. Um, all of our stuff for our new dock has been pretty much delivered. The only thing we are waiting on is to hear about the pilings. So as you guys know, this platform lasted through the hurricane. This is through flow decking. The, the waves just literally came up through it. So this was left with no damage whatsoever. So we knew that uh, we wanted to pretty much invest in doing the whole walkway, that same material the next time around. So that just got delivered. We have enough here to go all the way out and also redo our sitting area there. The other thing we wanted to change was all of the structural framing. So any of the wood that you see just kind of split there and cracked off. We wanted to do that with composite decking. So we have the structural framing over here from OC Lumber, which is a type of composite. And so the last thing we're doing is pulling up all of these piles here and going to raise the entire structure three feet so if you can see the condo that's over there um that one did last through the last the last hurricane just because it was the height of it the waves uh went through it but didn't really you know it was enough height that it wasn't like completely just pounding at it so we think that three feet difference is gonna make a huge difference as well so all these piles are going to be coming out insight marine is just finishing up one of their jobs so in a few weeks they'll be able to get back over here pull all of these out and then we're hoping to go with something called eco piles which is not wood piles it's a composite type pile but we are still waiting to hear about that um but we're trying to make a indestructible dock here if we can do it hurricane proof uh in perfect time for hurricane season the only thing we are leaving is our boat house up there we're going to save some money by just leaving those in place it has lasted us through now uh, a few storms but we are going to have to get a new lift you can see that that entire lift is like completely cockeyed like that so other than that we uh this will all be new and raised up and then obviously this is staying because it lasted but Hopefully with the new material and it being raised up, we will uh, be golden.